Hey guys, this is Johnny and I just came back from Pizza Patron. I hung out with Pika Chica and we were out there in that long line for almost an hour, well more than an hour, just to get in that little pizza shop and get some pizza. And since it was really hot, we actually, uh, well I went inside our Mercado to get like some little like um, slurpy type drinks. It actually tastes pretty good. It's very fresh and very refreshing. It tastes very natural. It doesn't taste like the, the junk you usually get in Slurpees. But anyways, uh, it was cool. And of course, since they're short on a lot of the pepperoni large pizza that they promoted, they also had the option to give you pizza with um, pepperoni with jalapenos. And they also had the option to give you, uh, in my case, pizza with um, pepperoni and ham. And Judy Cell obtained the Hawaiian pizza, so it was pretty cool. And the cool thing of it is that they also hand you these little coupons promotions so that you could still go there and check it out because it's really worth checking it out. Was it worth waiting there for an hour or so? Yeah, I guess so. But um, it really was very hot outside, so um, and of course. So that you guys can see what I'm talking about, this is the type of pizza they make. Yummy at El Patron. And as you can see, it has ham and pepperoni and all that good stuff. So um, it's pretty good. It's a pretty good promotion. And I kind of like it because it really makes you get curious about the place. I mean, I've never eaten at the Pizza Patron before. And now thanks to, to, the, um, to these promotions, it, it will make you want to go there again and again and again. So this is Johnny and I'm signing off. And I just basically telling you the good story about Pizza Patron and I all I could say is that to all the critics criticizing the place because oh you're using another language to get a pizza I mean you guys are really missing out all the fun I mean it's worth it the pizza's free and when you go to Taco Bell you're still ordering in Spanish I mean it's Mexican food when you go to Starbucks you're still ordering like your drinks is like cup size like in the Italiano so you're in reality, you're using a whole bunch of different languages, whether you realize it or not, just to order something. So, you know, this is what, you know, the country's about. It's a melting pot, and you're supposed to really embrace the different cultures and the diversity this country has to offer. So I really don't see the point why people made this into a big issue. But anyways, this is Johnny, and... Um, Hats off to the guys at Pizza Patron, and um, I'll be seeing you guys next time.